Okay, um, what's up everybody and welcome to another episode of How To's with Andy King powered by ZI Studio. Now, if you're following me, you remember from the last video that I made that talked about how I was able to transform this image from this, from this to this, right? And um, today I want to take our time to show you how I was able to color grade this image. And you might want to save this for later maybe a screenshot or something and if you send us a dm at said i used to do of course I'll, I'll send you um the lot that i use okay so um first of all I, I like to shoot my um footage on flat yes x log 2 or s log 3. now the reason why i shoot on s log is because i want my camera to be able to capture all the information that i'm getting at that moment so um so yeah, shooting on S-Log 2 helps increase your dynamic range. Um, that way you'll be able to capture the highlights and the shadows, you know. So um, not a waste of time. First thing you want to do, you want to um, come here and just um, open an adjustment layer and click OK. Um, we have that you might want to drag this on top of this and the next thing you want to do is go to creative and browse and this is one of my favorite um, lots that I like to use which is this one cool breeze yes you can see the difference so but you need to make some adjustment yes these adjustments are very, very important. So let's tweak some of these adjustments so you get to see. Um, you can see right here, I have my Lumetri scope um, just to give me a guideline so I don't get to um, do things without seeing what I'm doing. Okay, so um, I have to increase this a little bit and reduce my highlight more okay we just my highlight to about yep i think that's okay and i want to also drop down my shadow a little bit and also drop down my white yes um, drop down my white we're getting there gradually this i think yeah this works and um, uh, let's see let's see what are we missing okay let's trick this a little bit to the corner uh, 1.4 is fine and this a little bit so but trick it to your own satisfaction right so but this is how i like to create my uh, footage and i want to come to creative and increase this a little bit yeah so this is okay and my sharpness my sharpen yeah increase the sharpness yes uh, i think about let's say um yeah not too much i still want you to have that natural feel um next thing is increase my vibrance uh, let's push it all the way down to like let's say 16 and you might want to add a little bit of saturation just small five 105 is fine and so i'm coming down to my tint balance uh tint balance the next thing i want to do is uh, let's take this a little bit to this corner yes and crank this all the way up to about let's say yeah okay and you might want to add some cough to it as well so and down bring this down and take this up a little bit you want to increase this up a little bit to your curve and um yeah let's move down a little bit okay so my colorways and match uh, just increase this later and take this highlight down yes and more on this side 
Yeah, it's actually looking nice. Okay, let's see uh, what next. Let me see, I can still decide to drop down this and add more shadow to it. All right, it's looking more like it. So the next thing I want to do is go to my VidNet and um, just drop this down. This effect works for this, but that's too much. So you just want to like leave it somewhere here. A little bit, yeah, it's just too much and just later. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> it's looking, it's giving, right? The, the, it's actually giving. Okay, let's see the difference now. Um, let's see uh, before and after, a whole lot different. Um, so you can still decide to play around if you want. Um, let's see if I want to reduce um, the red on the skin just a little bit and just um, drop this on the skin and just cut down a little. Yes, just later. As you can see, the before and after. Hmm, a whole lot of difference, right? Now, um, if you want this lot, you can actually send a DM. Send us a DM at ZI Studio, and I'll make sure I get it across to you. But don't forget to like, comment, and share this video. Get to turn on your notifications so that when next we post, you'll be the first to see it. My name is Andy King, and until I see you again on another episode of How To's, powered by ZI Studio. Bye-bye.